Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge was the influence behind Prince William and Prince Charles' growing bond, a royal expert suggested. Despite their seemingly close bond as the next two royal heirs, the relationship between Prince Charles and Prince William hasn't always been plain sailing. Speaking on Palace Confidential, royal commentator Richard Kay spoke of how the Duchess of Cambridge is the driving influence behind the growing closeness between William and his father. Mr. Kay said, William's relationship with his father has not always been good. There's been a lot of friction between them over the years. He added, they seem to have a better understanding of one another, at present. I put a lot of all this down to the influence of Kate and the Middleton family and how they've, sort of, given him some new priorities in his life. The royal expert claimed that William is becoming a more significant figure within the royal family, adding that for a long time, William was content not to have that prominent role. In terms of his royal role, Mr. K said, he's slightly stepping out, if you like, of that long shadow cased by his father, Charles. He's, William. Intent on having his own views, he added that William is quite different in character and makeup from Charles and that the second in line to the throne has much more in common with the Queen. The royal commentator suggested that because of the differences the 40-year-old will take his duties as king in an entirely different way from those of his father. Last month, due to the Queen's absence, Prince Charles and Prince William joined forces to represent the 96-year-old at the state opening of Parliament event. The event took place on May 10 and marked the formal start of the parliamentary year. On the day, Charles took over the role of reading out the Queen's speech. The speech was read in the House of Lords chamber by the Prince of Wales. On the first day of Platinum Jubilee celebrations earlier this month, Prince Charles and Prince William, along with the Queen's daughter Princess Anne, rode on horses during the traditional carriage procession. The trio left the palace ahead of Trooping the Colour, also known as the Birthday Parade, at the start of the celebrations. Both royal heirs have taken on more prominent roles with the firm, particularly in recent months.